Hello there. So today we will uh, solve one of the lead code problem. Uh, logger rate limiter. Okay. So uh, there are some conditions that we need to meet. Okay. So where uh, here uh, problem student says design a logger system that receives a stream of messages along with their timestamp. Each unique message should only be printed at most every 10 seconds. That is a message printed at a timestamp t will prevent the other identical message from being printed until timestamp t plus 10. Okay. So the input statement uh, sample input is given here. So for foo, this is the first message on timestamp 1. Then bar uh, timestamp 2, both will be true. And uh, then again foo will come. But now uh, foo uh, doesn't ha doesn't have a difference of 10 seconds. So it will not be printed. Bar will also not be printed because uh, you can see uh, this doesn't have uh, the time difference of 10 milliseconds. Okay, 10 seconds. So uh, to solve that, I'll use a map and that will store the uh, timestamp and the message. So I'll use a uh, hash map. Map string. Integer to new has map and first of all I need to check if log dot get key okay so here it will be string masses if we have a key uh, is not equal to null means if it is equal to null first uh, first we'll check so if it doesn't uh, this message doesn't exist then we need to return true okay and at end i'll return false if none of the condition met and I put map dot put this message comma timestamp okay now else if it already exists then we need to check the 10 second timestamp okay and previous time equal to log dot get message now here if print time is less than equal to timestamp minus 10 then we need to return true and here I'll map dot put Masses comma timestamp. Okay. So I think that should solve uh, this issue. Return to expected semicolon uh, unexpected int logger. string and teaser teaser it will have no, no. this is the log this is the log I have taken log as the map yeah so it succeeds so that's all from today's video for implementation of this problem statement. If you think the videos are helpful, do like the video and subscribe to the channel. Okay. Thank you so much for watching. I have not used constructor here. I can easily use constructor to initialize this as map.